Anna Puchalowski with us here on the John Mandola Show, Abington Heights, second best in the state in AAA. That ain't no easy feat. Uh, let's talk about you and your teammates and how you're able to have such a successful season. Well, we're always having fun. I feel like that's like the key to our success. We know how to laugh. We know how to enjoy our time. Running is a tough sport, so it's it's nice to be able to relax with your teammates and do it with people you love. What's the first thing Coach said? He goes, man, these girls, they have stories. They are just, they're laughing all the time. So let's talk about just keeping things light and, and being able to laugh. Is there one in the group that's funnier than the other, or you guys are just constantly just like a fun group? It's a fun group, I'd say. We're all really close to each other, and I feel like the team dynamic is just really good. So that helps us be able to joke around with each other and not take things too seriously. How about pushing each other? How, you know, much are you like, hey, you know, I did a little better than her at practice, and then the next time she did, like, is there that competition within the team where it's not a jealous competition, but it's a good competition to say, you're going to make me better? Yeah, I say we motivate each other, not in, like, a competitive way, but, like, in a way like, hey, I did my run today. Like, did you do your run? Sending photos to check in on each other, stuff like that. Coach Bassetti is one of those guys that he just gets results. I don't, I don't know. He's got a great formula. He's just a, he's a unique dude. There's no doubt about it. He's a positive guy. Talk a little bit about, you know, his ability to push you ladies to get to another level. Coach Bassetti is a great coach. He's like really knowledgeable of the sport. He has so much experience and I, He's just a really trustable person. Yeah, I agree with you. He he, uh, he just, uh, you know, he's got that wittiness about him. And, uh, you know, it's just something about him. He's been doing it so long and at so many different schools, mostly Abington Heights. But uh, at the time, he had to go up north for a little bit. Now he's back in Abington Heights. Let's talk about the, the ladies and that part of getting to competition and then, you know, being able to finish a race and show up and, and, and run hard like you did, whether it was at districts or states, it's not easy. Not everybody always finishes, but, but you girls had a great race and good enough to be one of the best in the state. Yeah, we we stay motivated. We love just each other's company. We like doing runs together. It's really fun. It's a good atmosphere. Let's talk about the off season for you, if there is such a thing. Like, what are you gonna do here? December, January, February? indoor stuff like tell us a little bit about what you're going to do off seasons are my favorite seasons i love just training and putting in a lot of work and then seeing the results in the race seasons indoor i'm planning on doing a little bit of racing not too much i'm not a big fan of doing a lot of racing indoors and then i'm going to do a lot of training mostly speed oriented and strength oriented hopefully have a really killer track season let's talk about you know the, the runs like do you mind going out and running when it's 20 degrees or you know does that bother you a little bit or you're like hey this is how you get tougher or i like running hills i am not a cold person i hate the cold and i'm really sensitive to the cold but i still go out i do the runs if it's too too cold i'll go on the treadmill it's just anything to get it done now i've heard that there's been some very effective treadmill workouts uh, as opposed to maybe you got to hit the streets and go out for those so are there some particular treadmill workout you do or it's just like hey i'm going i'm got five miles there, i gotta go do it i like doing intervals on the treadmill so like time intervals or distance intervals and just switching between paces it makes the time go by faster and it's also good if you want to hit a specific pace for running because you could set the pace so you go with a little bit of spicy on the treadmill i guess mm -hmm. right keep it interesting yeah all right well it's good to catch up with you congratulations on a great year keep working hard thank you